Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect. As we left off, we took down another Thresher Maw, and now we're... Did I already take care of... No, I... Didn't I? It seems to be indicating that I didn't. I... That's where I am now. That's where I want to go. Okay, so I did already take care of that one. Well, that's a good start. Alright, across the plains, and if there's another Thresher Maw nearby, I swear to God. I don't think there would be. I think there's pretty much one per planet or moon, or whatever, as the case may be, but... Probably planets. Although I thought they liked sandy regions, not snowy. A bit perplexing, that. Whee! Okay. Ah! Looks like there's both a mineral deposit and an anom anomaly over this way. And I'm gonna run over it first. Cause you know, that's what we do. We run over things. I'm still going to save before I do anything. Because that's how I roll. The person's person was trying to mark the nearby mineral deposit when he died. Or was killed. By what? Iridium deposit. And this time I'm actually going to save again. Because... No! God damn it! Lindsay makes a fool of herself. Oh, ah. A small deposit of iridium. Now, does this mean I'm going to find myself ambushed? An abandoned camp, huh? Anomaly, we've already covered that one. Okay. So, abandoned camp. Well, this will go well. I'm sure there's absolutely nothing lurking waiting to kill us at the earliest convenience for it. There seems to be no one left at this camp. The generator is still functioning, but there are no signs of the former occupants. The camp's computer notes several locations of interest. Oh! Nice! It's leading us to the debris! You know, I bet it was killed by the Thresher Maw, then. Surveyors. Is this what happened to... that guy's men, then? They were sent to a planet that happened to have a Thresher Maw on it?
Ah, oh, found it. Really found it. Because I'm driving on it. Cobalt deposit. Well, I can't imagine why a planet composed largely of cobalt. would have a cobalt deposit. That just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Really? Really? Okay. I'm not gonna complain about it being easy. Alright, since this one's a little further away, let's go to the anomaly. Or further away from where we need to end up probably going. Beacon was a geth trap. Really? Oh shit. Ye. Ah. Shit, shit, shit. This has been one nice little death trap of a planet so far. How lovely of it to be full of shit. The Thresher Maw, the Geth. You wanna throw a Reaper at us next? I I'm not serious, by the way. Please don't. But that's where I already was, wasn't it? That's the one I wanna go to. Well, there I go, sucking at this again. Ah, not surprised. Have I mentioned that this isn't my usual genre of gameplay? Because it's still not. It, it still is really not. As I'm sure most of you are agreeing right now. Now where is this deposit? Down in there, is it? Palladium. I'm standing on top of it. Cause that's always a good sign, right? Tally, stop twitching. Are we a little stuck? Alright, let's try this. So, last place is the mercenary camp. Which is pretty much straight that way. Okay. And, hey, we're gonna be running into enemies! Huzzah! Turrets, even. I think 
I got my practice in before. Mercenary sniper, huh? Enjoy that. Really? I can't get it from this close? to put you in a world of pain. Take him down. Dipshits. So, what are we looking at here? Why, we are looking at... Another repeated environment! I will destroy you! No, you won't. Did it just moonwalk? You're saying I must All die? Down. You're saying I must die? Hmm. If that's your definition of me dying, I have bad news for you. No! I get a fucking easy one! And I still managed to fail it. Disposal canister. Okay. I guess we found nothing of interest in there. <laughs> and up the stairs here, coming around here, let's see. Power oh, I just push the crate back. Or that. Negative contacts, Commander. Tornado seven, huh? Uh huh. Tsunami 6, anything better in that department? No. Nope. Nope. Ooh. Ooh. And any other trickle down stuff? there. Although, that one... Okay. What's that? I can't
can't open it from over here. Mount, it says. Huh. I actually did not know that that was a thing. Once again, we save. No, God damn it. Damn, the Okay, whatever. Captain Willem. You have discovered the corpse of Captain Willem of the MSV Majesty. His stiff fingers are wrapped tightly around a small data pad. Mm -hmm. Well, seems as good a time as any to head back to the Citadel, huh? There should be some new stuff there anyway. It's been a while since we last visited, hasn't it? I'm sure that many people have many new things to say to us. And we still have to take care of Helena Blake's thing, don't we? Hmm. I should probably take care of that first. Now, where did I park my car? There, I did. So, Helena Blank's mission. Let's see. Cerberus, she's the gambler, hostile takeover, Helena Blank. And the hand system of the Gemini Sigma. So, Gemini Sigma. Okay. And we're done here. Gemini Sigma, there we go. Ming and Han. reference to Solo, or is this just a different thing? Because they do tend to work in a lot of uh, um, Star Wars references to their games. Is a large rock world of beryllium. Okay. Farkrothu. Alright. That was the first one we grabbed, yeah. Isn't there... So then the third one goes around to... Mavagon? Okay, it's one that I can land on, so that's probably where the mission is. Huningtu. Huningto. And Paravin. Matriarch's writings discovered. Scans of paraffin revealed an unmanned station in geosynchronous orbit. Your salvage team found no evidence on the origins of the station, but they did find one of Matriarch's Delanaga's writings on board. So. Mavagon. Let us go. Once again, I shall be taking my st- Wow. Background noise much? Alright, 
Syndicate hideout, but let's check out the debris first. Level 2 hazard. Oh, there's a wall there. Meaning if we step out, we're probably going to be running into... some other problems. Really? Oh, okay. Seems like that's actually the best way to go about things, is just go over a mountain wall. But it looks like we'll have an easier chance at the debris now that we've gotten past that. This is really nice for the sense of isolation, actually. The darkness, the lack of sky, the snow. Where is the debris? It's on the other side of this, isn't it? Or it's around through here. Which I will not object to. There we are. There it is. So we're going to park on it. And I'm going to save. I'm on my way. Let's see what we can do. Uh, really? No! God damn it. No! What? No! There we go. Okay, back in the makeup. And let's make our way over to the Syndicate hideout. After running over that. I'm sorry, I felt the need to fill in the bleak, you know, background noise here with my own little humming. Is it up on that mountain? It's up on the mountain, isn't it? And here I thought this was going to be a quick little jaunt. Alright, let's try going around this way. Seems to be bringing us closer at any rate. This is not an easy task. By any means. Oh my god. I think we got it. You think? Maybe? Just maybe? Alright, and on that note, I'm out of time for this installment of Let's Play Mass Effect, but I hope to see you next time where I continue my jaunt through into this syndicate area. Hope to see you then!